Divine Office Thursday Morning Prayer Lord, open my lips, and And my my mouth mouth will will proclaim proclaim your praise. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of Martyrs. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of Martyrs. Come, let us sing to the Lord, and shout with joy to the Rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving, and sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of martyrs. The Lord is God, the mighty God the great King over all the gods. He holds in his hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to him, the dry land too, for it was formed by his hands. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of martyrs. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For he is our God, and we are his people, the flock he shepherds. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of martyrs. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn, as your fathers did in the wilderness. When at Meribah and Massah, they challenged me and provoked me. Although they had seen all of my works. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of martyrs. Forty years I endured that generation. I said, they are a people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger. They shall not enter into my rest. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of martyrs. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us worship Christ, the King of martyrs. God's holy Dead love. 
At daybreak, be merciful to me, O Lord. At At daybreak, daybreak, be be merciful merciful to me, me, O Lord. Lord, Lord, listen to my prayer. Turn your ear to my appeal. You are faithful, you are just. Give answer. Do not call your servant to judgment, for no one is just in your sight. The enemy pursues my soul. He has crushed my life to the ground. He has made me dwell in darkness like the dead, long forgotten. Therefore my spirit fails. My heart is numb within me. I remember the days that are past. I ponder all your works. I muse on what your hand has wrought and to you I stretch out my hands. Like a parched land, my soul thirsts for you. Lord, make haste and answer, for my spirit fails within me. Do not hide your face, lest I become like those in the grave. In the morning, let me know your love, for I put my trust in you. Make me know the way I should walk. To you I lift up my soul. Rescue me, Lord, from my enemies. I have fled to you for refuge. Teach me to do your will, for you, O Lord, are my God. Let your good spirit guide me in ways that are level and smooth. For your name's sake, Lord, save my life. In your justice, save my soul from distress. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it it was was in the beginning, beginning, is now, now, and and will be forever. forever. Amen. Amen. Lord Jesus, early in the morning of your resurrection, you made your love known and brought the first light of dawn to those who dwell in darkness. Your death has opened a path for us. Do not enter into judgment with your servants. Let your Holy Spirit guide us together into the land of justice. At At daybreak, daybreak, be be merciful merciful to me, me, O Lord. Lord. The Lord will make a river of peace flow through Jerusalem. The Lord Lord will will make make a a river river of peace flow flow through through Jerusalem. Jerusalem. Rejoice with Jerusalem and be glad because of her, all you who love her. Exalt, exalt with her, all you who are mourning over her. Oh, that you may suck fully of the milk of her comfort, that you may nurse with delight at her abundant breasts. For thus says the Lord, Lo, I will spread prosperity over her like a river, and the wealth of nations like an overflowing torrent. As nurslings you shall be carried in her arms and fondled in her lap, as a mother comforts her son, so will I comfort you. In Jerusalem you shall find your comfort. When you see this, your heart shall rejoice, and your bodies flourish like the grass. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as As it it was was in the the beginning, 
is now, now and, and will, will be forever. forever. Amen. The Lord will make a river of peace flow through Jerusalem. Let us joyfully praise the Lord our God. Let, Let us, us joyfully praise the Lord our God. God. Praise the Lord, for he is good. Sing to our God, for he is loving. To him our praise is due. The Lord builds up Jerusalem and brings back Israel's exiles. He heals the brokenhearted. He binds up all their wounds. He fixes the number of the stars and calls each one by its name. Our Lord is great and almighty. His wisdom can never be measured. The Lord raises the lowly. He humbles the wicked to the dust. O sing to the Lord, giving thanks. Sing psalms to our God with the harp. He covers the heavens with clouds. He prepares the rain for the earth, making mountains sprout with grass and with plants to serve man's needs. He provides the beasts with their food and young ravens that call upon him. His delight is not in horses, nor his pleasure in warrior strength. The Lord delights in those who revere him and those who wait for his love. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it, as it was, was in the beginning, beginning is now, now and, and will, will be forever. forever. Amen. Amen. God our Father, great builder of the heavenly Jerusalem, you know the number of the stars and call each of them by name. Heal hearts that are broken. Gather together those who have been scattered and enrich us all from the plentitude of your eternal wisdom. Let, Let us, us joyfully praise the Lord our God. God. A reading from Second Corinthians. Praised be God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of mercies, and the God of all consolation. He comforts us in all our afflictions, and thus enables us to comfort those who are in trouble with the same consolation we have received from Him. As we have shared much in the suffering of Christ, so through Christ do we share abundantly in His consolation. The Word of the Lord. The Lord is my strength, and I shall sing his praise. The Lord is my strength, and I shall sing his praise. The Lord is my Savior, and I shall sing his praise. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The Lord is my strength, and I shall sing his praise. I seek him who died for us. I long for him who rose for our sake. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, 
holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and and will will be forever. forever. Amen. I seek him who died for us. I long for him who rose for our sake. Our Savior's faithfulness is mirrored in the fidelity of his witnesses who shed their blood for the word of God. Let us praise him in remembrance of them. You You redeemed redeemed us by your your blood. Your martyrs freely embraced death in bearing witness to the faith. Give us the true freedom of the Spirit, O Lord. You You redeemed redeemed us us by by your your blood. blood. Your martyrs professed their faith by shedding their blood. Give us a faith, O Lord, that is constant and pure. You You redeemed redeemed us 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 by by your blood. Your martyrs followed in your footsteps by carrying the cross. Help us to endure courageously the misfortunes of life. You You redeemed redeemed us us by by your blood. Your martyrs washed their garments in the blood of the Lamb. Help us to avoid the weaknesses of the flesh and worldly allurements. You You redeemed redeemed us us by by your blood. blood. And now let us pray with confidence as Christ our Lord asked. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as as we forgive those who trespass against us. And And lead us not into into temptation, but but deliver deliver us from from evil. evil. Almighty, ever-living God, who adorn the sacred body of your Church with the confessions of holy martyrs, grant, we pray, that just as the glorious passion of St. Ignatius of Antioch, which we celebrate today, brought him eternal splendor, so it may be for us an ending protection. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life.